we decided to get lunch. It's a local brewery here called Straight to L. Um, we ordered two of their craft beers. I got the Brothers Joseph. It's a double bock. And what did what you get? I got a Blood Brothers, a, a blood orange type beer. And if you angle down, you can see what we got as an appetizer. We end up going with the poutine, if I'm saying that right. Poutine. Canadians, yeah. <laughs> Canadians, please don't like rip my face off because I don't know. <laughs> so we're gonna eat this poutine, <laughs> which sounds funny to say, and drink these beers, and then we'll get back with you after lunch. The Lamborghini. Kevin's got the wasabi. What's it called? I can't remember. I said it in the first part. Apocalypse Chow. Yeah. <laughs> Kevin's got the Apocalypse Chow. Kind of like the Apocalypse Now, like the movie. Yeah. There's a mile of that. I didn't make it through. I lost out the Ubotanium. Mine made it to the semifinals. <laughs> like it. That's good. That was a good beer. Yeah. And those hints were good. All right, let's walk back here. So we just finished eating and this whole brewery complex, and I call it a complex because it's more than just straight to L in this complex. And it's in an old school. Instead of tearing down the school and rebuilding it, I assume, we didn't ask anybody, I assume that they built a new school somewhere else and then they turned this over and they, this is what they turned it into. Um, this is really cool because right now where they're, I don't know if this is all the breweries or if it's just the straight to L brewery part. If you turn around, I'm, you've already been shown at the microbrewery. Can you get that over there? This was, put that on. <laughs> you can tell that this part of the school was the actual gymnasium. They got the, the old scoreboard over there. They got pictures in here. This is pretty cool concept. So yeah, there are several breweries in this complex. Uh, we went to straight to Ale because they had the dining, but Yellowhammer and Campus 805 is also in the same complex. Print the cans there? Oh, let's check it out. They got the neon sign ready for the new year. I wonder oh. if they're going to do a new year's party up here. They might. And they got a big ass fan. They got two big ass fans. I mean, that's the name of it. Big yeah. ass fan. <laughs> Aside from straight to ale, Campus 805 boasts a ballroom, event center, a sushi bar, several restaurants and bars,
Catering, a coffee bistro, X-Golf, which is a virtual golfing experience, a hair salon, axe throwing, and a tattoo parlor, just to name a few of the businesses in the campus. So Stone Center, that was where we parked across from. They got an event center, hops and block, on Goose and the uh, Offbeat Coffee Studio. Ooh, they got an axe throwing here. <laughs> Shoot. Yeah. So we parked like right here, across from there. This is where the Straight to Ale is, 21, and Ale's Cafe. That's so cool. You know that's after like Ronald Reagan. I, yeah. They used to call him that in the 80s. The uh, <laughs> Yellow Hammer Brewing. Where's that? Yellow Hammer Brewing. What number is it? 30? <clears throat> 30. Okay, so that's... Okay, so this must be the football field over here. Butler Green. It looks like it, it used to be live concerts and venues. Yeah. That's what that looks like. And then the Student Union Building is over here. What's, what's their rock and roll sushi? Oh, wow. Where's my dad? Oh, okay. Because <laughs> we're right here. Right? Yeah. <laughs> See how cans are made. This is the main bar of the Straight to Ale. This is the story of how Campus 805 came to be the South's premier brewery and entertainment venue. The Huntsville City School System closed Stone Middle School in 2009 and put the property on the market to sell. It took five years to find a buyer. In 2014, a developer purchased the property to create a unique development that would preserve the legacy of the school and offer a dynamic entertainment venue for the community. Straight to Ale Brewery and Yellow Hammer Brewery were the first tenants to sign on the new project. Architects and interior designers were tasked with updating the school building and designing new brewery, restaurant, entertainment, and retail spaces to blend in with the campus look and feel. The project became campus number 805. The name pays homage to memories held by thousands of students, teachers, parents, and administrators that were part of this campus and to the West Huntsville neighborhood by claiming the last three digits of their zip code, 35805. It's closed right now though, right? Yeah. yeah. It's Friday and Saturday. This is the speakeasy. This is only open Friday and Saturday nights at 5. What's interesting about this speakeasy? Oh, uh yeah. -huh. 
Video evidence. Yeah. You know, you're not supposed to do that. It's a secret. <laughs> that was the door. <laughs> Pretty good. They got an outdoor beer garden uh, where we had those fantastic burgers and food. Came out of Ale's Kitchen. Fantastic food. So the next time you're in Huntsville, Alabama, Stop by Campus 805 and straight to Ale. Until next time, where will the road take you?